punter. That's going to be interesting. So Carpenter booting it away. And the spring game begins, and they're just going to blow that dead before the tackle. Again, we're coming up Friday or Saturday <laughs> with this weather forecast. And a big hole. Rodney Smith shirt and play the following season. But he was the Batman alongside Rodney Smith for a great one-two combo. And here a nice pass complete to Rodney Smith. How about this? Rodney Smith, the red shirt senior. Showing that experience pays off. He's into the end zone for the first touchdown of the spring. Slow if you watch. Look at his eyes. He kept his eyes downfield. He's outside the perimeter. He's not looking at where the defenders are. He's not worried about getting hit. Find someone open and he put the ball right on the money. Exceptions. That's not going to win you many ball games. Yeah, just nine touchdowns indeed. Ibrahim with a nice hole out towards midfield. Line. He was the O-line coach at Western Michigan when P.J. Fleck and staff were there. Nice throw over the middle. Tanner Morgan connecting with Tyler Johnson. The uniform. So the question will be, what do they have around him this coming year? Ibrahim out of the backfield. Down inside the 10 goes Muhammad Ibrahim. Running back spot last year. He graduated. This is a keeper. And the ball's on the ground. Yeah, here's the quarterback keep coming out the backside. It's really impressive by the defense rallying to the football, making a good hit down on the goal line, forcing a fumble. Junior Huff, a senior. You know what you're getting from those two guys. Pressure. And Tanner Morgan tried to flip it, and he did get it to Ibrahim, but there is a flag down his short chip shot field goal here. Of 26 yards. And Emmett Carpenter, who is 36 of 44 in his career as a field goal kicker in a gopher uniform, knocks it through. So we saw a great first drive from Zach Anikstead. And this is what he can do. He's a dual threat guy. And I bet P.J. Fleck loves to see that right off the bat. And that's what we remind me of. And two years ago, Mitch Leidner, a guy did the Gophers do a nine-win season. And here's a sack and a strip by Blaze Andrews. Yeah, you got to protect. He turns and he can't see the backside coming. You see the guy that messed up on pass protection recovered the fumble. <laughs> Good for him. Winding down again. The clock will run in all four quarters here in the spring game. Deep ball, batted free, intended for Chris Ockman Bell. A play action, and they go back to Douglas. Oh, he had it stripped. And it's picked up by Antonio Chanel. They were high on him a year ago, and then he got banged up and didn't play. Now he's back healthy, and you got to put that ball away. Jacob Huff, good strip, and then Chanel. Third down and nine. And it's back to Smith. And a good result. Rodney Smith is in once more. Yeah, I tell you, you know, every guy makes his own line out, but last coach is number one. I'd be sending him over there for some hot chocolate. Man, with Kendra and Sharon. Back to you guys. Thanks, Kendra. Yeah, he saw nine wins two years ago and then a five and seven season last year, Rodney Smith. Another nice run. Muhammad Ibrahim showing what it was a move at the start of spring ball because he did begin spring as a quarterback. Nice catch on the sideline. There's Tyler Johnson. Your shovel they, ready? They've updated it. You got your shovel? I'm sure you do. Ibrahim is pushed out near the five. They, so keep, they keep updating by the... Swenson, who I mentioned wants to be an orthopedic surgeon that we saw on the sideline. Ooh. And for the backside, the ball is free. Tanner Morgan had it stripped by Julian Hobbs. Backside here. Yeah, they got a little stunt. You can see it was right away the blind side of the quarterback and you look at by P.J. Fleck with a scholarship for this coming fall for the redshirt junior. Quarterbacks have been under a lot of pressure as of late and Anikstead is taken down by Calvin Swenson, the future doctor. He's just decided it's been Zach Anikstead, Vic Veramontez. Those are the three quarterbacks that we have seen so far. Pressure coming. Morgan stepping up and completing it. Another nice pass and another one to Tyler Johnson. Those two. 
Morgan fighting for time. What a, what a catch! Tyler Johnson! Touchdown, Maroon! What? Yeah, right there. Watch him here, he his eyes. And I think I only need one hand to catch it. Just think about that. To producer and director Pat O'Connor for help picking out those two players as well. Big hole over the middle. Jonathan Femi Cole, that's the first carry. Up tempo. And getting the calls in for the sidelines. Oh, he dropped it. Came right out of Aramontez's hands. Yeah, he tried to pull it on the zone read, and, which he did pull it out, but he didn't secure it. Samuel Pickering is the only other quarterback listed on the Maroon roster. Off play action. And that's Matt Moores. Yes. Bubble screen would be good. That's Keandre Thomas, the corner, who gave a lot of room. And the pass is caught. Touchdown, and guess who? Tyler Johnson. So Johnson has both touchdowns for the Maroon team, just like Rodney Smith has both for the gold team. If you look at right there, they just throw him the ball. He can't get it. And if you let a receiver run off the football like Tyler Johnson, he's going to turn most defensive backs around, which he did right there. Double in the ground. Do you have a hard hat on? Uh, yeah. yeah. Across the 50, a catch is made. Paul Gossage. Three more receivers coming in in the fall, including a four-star Rashad Bateman that they're very high on, and they're high on that man, Chris Ottman Bell. No reception. She's trying. Another catch. So Zach Anikstead at quarterback, starting to get into a groove. He finds Philip Howe. Started. He made plays like you couldn't believe. And it's usually the opposite, yeah. right? You get the practice heroes. Speaking of heroes, we've called this guy's name a couple of times, Tayon Devers, the junior. Certainly hoping to turn it around from the underwhelming 2017 as Evan Carpenter is able to boot it through. People still walking across that thing. Yeah, you'll be tough. You'll be out there ice fishing Saturday looking for some Northern Pike. That ball is stripped free of Tanner Morgan. The guy who stripped it was Boye Mafe, another red shirt freshman. This throw caught right in front of Jacob Huff. Demetrius Douglas was able to catch it. It's my defense. I'm going to go on fourth down. We don't get it. I'm going to hold him on down here. Just a chip shot, 18-yarder, as close as you can get. Minnesota Athletics. And, and I, I can tell you, no coach when you coach here at the University of Minnesota has a better friend than Mr. Dick Ames. A fumble on the Vera Montez carry. He just came back into the game for Zach Anikstead at quarterback. And they say Devers recovered it for the Maroon team. Yeah. Bunch of guys flying around there. Bailey Schoenfeld. Watch the play clock. Morgan swung down. Lynn Mason stepping up to the plate. Play fake. And there's more pressure on the quarterback. Royal Silver was leading the way, the big D tackle. By the way, had a huge offseason in the weight room, according to the coaches. What a catch. Chris Ottman Bell. A huge third and 17 conversion for the Gold Squad. Extend another play fake. Dancing, dancing, nowhere to go. Pocket collapses again on it. But you can't take the sack because the protection was good enough not to get a sack. And a little bit of a coverage sack. Offman Bell able to break free. Dragged out at midfield by Swenson. Six early enrollees, 20 more scholarship freshmen will come in the fall. And instead taking off. And diving across the 40 for the first down. They pick it up. It's a moot point. It's a moot point. First down. Howard. Just shy of the 20. Ned Morgan, correct? I didn't see the other guy throw it yet. No, Veramontes has been all on the ground. Well, that one was a little bit behind him, but still a, re a catch. The defense has been so aggressive, though. All the fumbles that have been on the ground for the quarterbacks. 
with the pressure off the edge. Up the middle, and the gold team scores with 58 seconds left. Jonathan Femi Cole hits Pater. Who do you want? Give him a fresh set of down. Morgan buying time underneath. Ibrahim, we've seen him a lot running at that time, Morgan's catching it out of the backfield. Back. Morgan evading everybody and taking off. Oh, he stays inbound. Dave Flex said this quarterback has the it factor. Does he have it here? Well, they do go quick and out of bounds. Richmond Tanner Morgan takes the snap. Oh, it got batted down and the game is over. Hit as he released it, and the gold team hangs on to win. And they hang on.